In this video, I'm going to be talking about the Samsung Odyssey G5's best settings for Xbox Series S or X. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. If you are using the Samsung Odyssey G5 to play on an Xbox Series S or X, you will be able to customize its settings to ensure that you get the best graphical quality possible. You will enhance the colors and make sure that you are using the monitor to its full potential on your Xbox console. So, all of this can be done by using the buttons below the monitor. By using the buttons located here, you will be able to access the menu and change a lot of settings about it. Of course, there are some settings that you will be changing on the actual Xbox settings, but to start, you should always use this menu here. You will have the picture category at the left, and this is always going to be the most important one. This is a preset that I recommend at the right side of the screen. So for picture mode, make sure that you set it to custom. This will allow you to change a bunch of things about it. If you are lazy and you don't want to spend too much time setting this up, you can browse through all of the presets instead. So for the brightness, change it according to comfort. Start with 65 and see if your eyes feel bad. If you believe there is too much light escaping the monitor, then lower it and do it accordingly. For contrast, 75 is ideal. Sharpness should be set to 48, and of course, you can do this according to your preference if you like a sharper image, but 48 is going to be the sweet spot. For the color, do 49, 49, and 48 for RGB. This will take a little bit of the bluish tint away. Gamma mode to 1, black level or normal, eye saver mode off, and you will be able to change these settings here according to your preferences. So language, display, time, and for the system, OSD settings, make sure that you turn dynamic brightness off. With these main settings on the picture category changed, you will have the best experience possible when using the Samsung Odyssey G5 to play. The next thing to ensure is that you have the resolution set accordingly when you go over to the settings on Xbox, so go to this TV and display options and you will find resolution and refresh rate. So depending on your specific G5 model, you will have access to 1440p, and this is very important because this will be the best resolution possible to play, and make sure that you increase the refresh rate as high as it can go. If you cannot see these high refresh rates, it could indicate that you are using a low quality HDMI or DP cable, so make sure to change those if needed. I hope I was able to help you on the Samsung Galaxy G5 best settings for Xbox Series S or X. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.